Greetings, I am Harry Larry from Gary, and this is episode 1715 of The Sims 4 Gallery Lots, and this particular lot is called Tiny Tots Daycare. It is on a 20 by 20 lot type generic, a little bit of a description, you're more welcome to read. Go through these photos, see if, I, if it does it justice or not. Uh, not really. Kind of. All right, let's go take a look at the real thing here. As soon as I can get over there. There we go. Sadly, we got the harsh afternoon sunlight going on. But that looks pretty cool. And so I uh, rescued Ditto from The Sims 4 daycare to bring him to this daycare. I think you'll have much more fun here. I've seen some. I didn't. Ooh, I like that look. Yeah, if I was driving by here, I definitely think it might probably would be a dry or a daycare. All right, let's go down, take a look around. I always like those pinwheels over there. That's a pretty little place. Yeah, definitely Daker. Or a balloon store. And you don't see many balloon stores anymore. But that looks cool. All right, let's go on in and take a look around. Of course, we have to see what's over here. Not much. Take a peek around the corner. Kids definitely would want to play over there by the electrical area. Well, first off, let's take a look back. Why do I want to go? I think I'm going to go to the kitchen first. So we'll slide that door open. Well, yeah, definitely it made that noise. It wasn't me. Nice job of trying to line that up perfectly. Just snap there. Either way, it looked pretty cool. I like this kitchen. This lot is playable. There was nothing I found that needed to be fixed, which is always a good thing. Nice little dining area. Let's go take a look out this door. Nice little outdoor theater. A 
I did not take a look at the swings. That looks like there's enough room for them. More pinwheels. So to me, this is the back, even though by the picture it's the front. But since I seen the mailbox on the other side, I considered that the front. But maybe it's just a little half block. Or there's an alley over there. Let's go take a look at the track end. This is looking pretty cool. Yeah, definitely, I like that. Take a look at the front. Well, maybe that is the front, because usually the front desk is by the front. And that's much farther away. Huh? Okay, I chose the other way. That looks pretty cool. Come up a bit. I see you over there, Dino. We'll take a high look at everything first, and then we'll uh, go down. Okay, let's take a look at the, this area first. This is a fun little area. Big fan of these doll uh, things right there. Doll and uh, doctor's bag. Where the kids get empathy and all that. Is that all of them? I think there's a couple more. Oh, that's a good spot for a rubber ducky. That looked really cool. That is a nice play area. All right, let's go up to the second floor. I'm thinking this as a little daycare, though. Say this is a little bit for more of the older kids here. Ooh, a door. We're going to go through this door. And since we're here, yes, I am waving. You're more than welcome to wave back. Or not. All right. I got a frogger. Let us see if there's a uh, blue paper or not. No, but you do get a plunger. So that's always a good thing. Now, 
nice bathroom area. I do know there's a toddler toilet somewhere around here. Because I did see one. That looks weird. I like the horns on it. Kind of reminds me of some uh, Star Wars there. Except for the mouth. The mouth reminds me of a platypus. But platypuses don't have horns. Or at least a Lady Elaine didn't. Hopefully I said the right name. It's been a long time. If you know your Mr. Rogers, anyways. I do believe there was a platypus on there. I like this room. This is a fun room. Older kids would be here all the time. I think so, anyways. Or at least the cool kids. Or kids with uh, a couple extra bucks. Alright, let me find the mailbox and we'll uh, take a closer look at this build. About the mailbox. Alright, as always, if you end up enjoying this lot and or video, you're always more welcome to give the video a thumbs up. If you find yourself enjoying my content and you're not a subscriber, well, you're always more welcome to subscribe. I just like the look of that right there. I wonder if they put a wall there and they took the wall away. To those of you who already are my subscribers, well, I thank you very kindly. Hopefully, I keep on making content that you enjoy watching. I like this place. That looks really nice. If you have anything to say, you're always more welcome as well to put it in the comments. And, of course, you're always more welcome to share this video. If you know anybody would like to see this lot in video form. And, of course, the most important thing of all, please take a look at this creator's other creations. That's a nice one. And this one's definitely one of them. I like the little lattice out there. That looks pretty cool. Excellent job on the fancy though. I just like that look right there. All right, well, let's go for a top down view. And since we basically had a flat roof, 
I believe we have no problem with the sea lanes. Let's double check. I don't know. Uh, all right. I can't give you a definite answer if it has a ceiling or not. Yes, I can. Let's do it this way. We have a ceiling. So this place is going to be nice and toasty warm during the summertime. Pardon me. During the winter time. I definitely like the look of this place. And since the rest of it's flat rough, I have no problems with those sailings as well. I definitely do like the kids play area. And that area is really cool as well. Actually, I like the whole build. How's that? All right, there is no basement, so let me see if I can find a pretty good spot to showcase this off. That might work right there. All right. So hopefully I'll catch you on the next episode. And until then, later.